is a coconut milk and palm sugar dish. Simple and fresh. It's just an agar agar dessert, which is um, this stuff here. It looks a bit like plastic string, but it's actually derived from seaweed. And it's a setting agent and it's basically Asian gelatin. Yep. So what I'm going to do... And it sets at room temperature, doesn't it? Yeah. Which is the, which is the great thing. Which and is perfect for tropical countries, yeah. no refrigeration. And I just want to rinse this in some cool water and it kind of absorbs the water really quickly. Mm. And just squeeze that out. And then put this in some water and bring it to the boil. And this will dissolve. And cooking it boiling it activates it, doesn't it? So yeah. it makes it gel. With agar agar desserts in Thai cooking, they'll boil it for quite a while, for three or four minutes, sometimes even five minutes, and it makes it firmer. They also like the crunch. How it of breaks it. apart, yeah. not like jelly. It doesn't yeah. spring back. It collapses yeah. right away in yeah. between your teeth. Yeah. OK, so the agar's dissolved, and now I'm just going to add some caster sugar and also some palm sugar. Yep. And we're just going to put in the coconut cream okay, now. So can I, I can just do that. All I have to do now is run it through a sieve to make sure there's no lumps, put it into a container and let it set. Dave, I want you to try my little dessert, which is the palm sugar and coconut agar. Which is just in Thai called wun nam dan. Sometimes they'll do it with coconut and uh, pandanus, mm -hmm. sometimes with coffee. Or, as you've done it, just with some palm sugar as well. Well, if you taste it, it does have qualities mm. of coffee in it. Mm. Nice and deep. It's a nice and easy dessert. Mm. Simple. Kind of refreshing. Well, it's a refresher after the complexity of this little number over here. Mm. I think this is a texture that a lot of Australians will find foreign because it looks like a jelly, but it does collapse very easily in your mouth. Well, it's just a crunchy jelly, you know. Yeah. I think Australians will become accustomed to it very quickly and very easily because it's an agreeable little number. Mm. Cheers.